Hello everybody, welcome back. So today we are making a chili chocolate red velvet cake inspired by the zodiac sign Taurus. So I decided to do something super fun on my channel for the next year. Um, so at the beginning of every different star signs birthday period, I'm going to be doing a dessert inspired by that. So this month is Taurus. So if you're born anywhere between April 20th and May 21st, that means you are a Taurus. So we are making a Taurus shaped, <laughs> bowl shaped, chili chocolate red velvet cake. And I thought that since it's sometimes seen as like a fiery or like spunky sign, I'd make a chili chocolate cake. This cake is so good and the buttercream, I I just ate it by the spoonful when I was waiting to ice it. So it's so, so good. And it's red velvet, which is so delicious. So let's get started. So first we're gonna bake the cake. In a small bowl, whisk together some cake flour, salt, cocoa powder, chili powder, and cayenne pepper and set that aside. So in this recipe, I wanted to make sure that there was like a chili flavor punch, but if you're sensitive to chili or if you just don't like things that spicy, this isn't that spicy. Like I can't handle spice, but I like it because there's still like a chili flavor, but you can definitely cut the amount of cayenne pepper and chili powder in half if you want something much more subtle or just leave it out of the buttercream or the cake because both of them have the chili powder in it. it but yeah, it's totally up to you. I normally don't like anything chili chocolate, but this cake is so good. So I'm um, definitely tried it. <laughs> Then combine some sugar and oil with an electric mixer, beating until well combined. Add the egg and mix well. Then add some red food coloring and vanilla extract and mix until combined. Then add the flour mixture in two additions, alternating with some buttermilk. In a small bowl, combine some baking soda and vinegar, and then add this to the batter and mix to combine. Divide the batter between two greased and floured nine inch round cake pans. Bake at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for 30 to 40 minutes. Cool in the pan for five minutes, then turn out onto a wire rack and cool completely. So to make this delicious cream cheese frosting, you wanna be some cream cheese and butter with an electric fixer until it's pale and fluffy. Add the vanilla extract and beat until combined. Add the confectioner's sugar one cup at a time. Then in a separate bowl, combine some cocoa powder, chili powder, and cayenne pepper, and then add this to the frosting and mix for two to three minutes or until it's light and fluffy. Spread some buttercream between each layer and coat the cake in an even layer of buttercream. Place a sheet of parchment paper on a cooking sheet, small enough to fit into your fridge. Use white candy melts to draw the bull's nose and horns, and dark chocolate candy melts to draw the eyes and ears. Draw nostrils onto the white nose and pupils onto the eyes with dark candy melts, and draw red candy centers onto the ears. Place in the fridge until set. Then just stick the chocolates onto the cake and you are done! So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you like this recipe. If you like this concept, definitely give this video a thumbs up and also tell me if you believe in them. I don't know, I'm such a skeptic, but I'm a Virgo and every time I look up what Virgos are, it's like me to a T. So I don't know, I'm skeptical, but I also believe it. I don't know, it's, it's for fun anyways. And I love you guys so much and I will see you next Tuesday for an only recipe.